celebration and recognition of science and technology. FIRST. When inventor Dean came and founded FIRST, he not only wanted to teach kids the values of science, technology, engineering, and math, he also wanted to instill the core values of cooperation, competition, education, and fun. The first games were held in 1992 with 28 teams convening in a high school gym. The yearly competition has exponentially grown to reach a quarter of a million U's in the 2013 championships which were held in the Edward Jones Dome in St. Louis, Missouri. And right here in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, FTC team number 127, the Fighting Pickles from Ben Barber Technical Academy are preparing themselves for this year's challenges. First is for inspiration and recognition of science and technology, but it's, uh, for me, it's a great way to get experience in what you're really interested in, in robotics and programming and engineering. Uh, I feel like FIRST is trying to help promote education and relate it to real world experiences and make us learn what engineering does and how it can affect us and, you know, help us build a future around it. And I'm really thankful for that. I've had a passion for engineering since I was in middle school. Being on a team helps me understand how to work as a team and it really just brings us all together. And I think the best part is, is designing it from the start and having it all come together. Like I came in here not knowing any kind of programming and now I know most of the basic programming, some advanced programming. It's uh, awesome and uh, fantastic and frustrating at the same time. Um, you know, the expectation cannot be that they're full-on engineers or computer scientists at this point when they're just starting out. Uh, so it's exciting and uh, amazing to see them when they learn new ideas and apply those and really follow the engineering process and have successes with that. It can be hard uh, being a facilitator and not necessarily jumping in and solving all the problems. Uh, but. Uh, you got to sit back and hope to, they can uh, follow the instructions. You do step in a little more and you know, guide them, especially when they're having problems, and uh, you know, teach them how to overcome those problems. The experience of being able to use my programming and have it affect real-world uh, applications um, is very beneficial because in the classroom, you don't really get the effect of seeing how programs can run amok in the real world, how things aren't always exactly right. We're just making some final touches, but uh, if everything goes according to plan, we should be able to do very well. And uh, I hope that we can not only compete well, but uh, just work well with other teams and get a very good uh, feeling for what FIRST is all about, which is teamwork and uh, just the help of community.